Looking to read more Indiana authors? Every month, the Indiana Authors Awards releases a new book review highlighting a recent book by a Hoosier author reviewed by a Hoosier writer. This month, we are sharing a review by Francesca Zappia on The Scarlet Veil by Shelby Mahurin. The Scarlet Veil by Shelby Mahurin, reviewed by Francesca Zappia. Shelby Mahurin's The Scarlet Veil comes on the heels of her best-selling Serpent and Dove series and is set in the same French-inspired world of witches, hunters, and other dark and sexy supernatural creatures. Silly Trembly, a girl haunted by the events of the recent past, has joined the ranks of the huntsmen to prove her mettle. She's not magical, nor is she great with weapons, but she's smart and resourceful, two traits that go unrecognized when dressed up in a beautiful, soft, feminine exterior. The captain of the huntsmen and Silly's fiancé, Jean-Luc, is the first to dismiss her. The situation is frustratingly realistic and sets in motion the story of Silly uncovering and believing in her innate worth and strength. When supernatural creatures start turning up murdered, Silly devotes herself to uncovering the truth, with or without the help of the other huntsmen. Her investigation is quickly hamstrung, however, by the appearance of a powerful and ancient vampire who has other plans for her. Silly's journey will resonate with anyone who has ever felt small among their friends and especially with girls and women who have spent their lives dismissed for their beauty, their emotions, their kindness, or their history. The book shines in the moments where Silly is allowed to voice her fears and frustrations and the characters who previously dismissed her must listen. The relationship between Silly and her friends will delight readers returning to the Serpent and Dove world and will provide new readers a compelling reason to check out the previous books. But the most important relationship is Silly's bond with her dead sister, Philippa. Mahurin deftly captures the complexities of sisters growing up together and growing apart and how Philippa shapes Silly's identity both before and after death. Silly's softness and vulnerability are a breath of fresh air in a genre often overcorrecting for past sexism. The women in the Scarlet Veil are varied in their abilities, strengths, and motivations, allowed to be ambitious heroines and clever villains, fashionable nobles and adept fighters, all without the narrative casting judgment upon them or rendering them one-dimensional. And if that's not enough to get you to read, come instead for the lush atmosphere, the deliciously creepy details, and the themes of embracing one's strengths despite overwhelming opposition and fear. The cliffhanger ending will leave readers frothing for the next book. Francesca Zappia is the award-winning author of young adult books, including Eliza and Her Monsters, Pats and Yammer, and Grey Mist Fair. She has a bachelor's degree in computer science and a master of business administration from the University of Indianapolis. She lives in Indiana with her good dog Gus and spends her free time baking, playing video games, and watching terrible movies. Shelby Mahurin is the New York Times best-selling author of the Serpent and Dove trilogy. She grew up on a small farm in rural Indiana where sticks became wands and cows became dragons. Her rampant imagination didn't fade with age, so she continues to play make-believe every day with words now instead of cows. When not writing, Shelby watches The Office and reads ferociously. She still lives near that childhood farm with her very tall husband and semi-feral children. Visit her online at www.shelbymahurin.com. Thanks for listening to February's book review. Check back every month for a new recommendation or look for the review in your local paper.